inside Marine Corps Air Station Iwakuni's Southside Mess Hall. Marine chefs race to put the finishing touches on a range of unique confections and eateries. Amid the chaos in cooking, an excitement is in the air for today's Chef of the Quarter competition. This isn't the standard military menu, and some of these creations have no written recipes. The Marines are pulling out all the stops to impress, and the effort inside the kitchen is matched only by the elaborate display tables, where their fine cuisine will soon be featured. Four judges from the Air Station's Headquarters and Headquarters Squadron will be presented with each chef's three-course meal. And while there will be first and second place winners among the participants, winning isn't necessarily everything. I was honestly looking forward to seeing everybody be actually be able to step out their comfort zone and to do what they actually wanted to do, have that full 100% creativity. There's no bounds. Do what your heart is content. Just to be in this competition boosts your confidence. You're basically out here with the best that we have right now. It's pretty intimidating and the whole thing is just, you know, you want to put the best thing out. The food ranged in taste and style, from exotic Puerto Rican signatures to classy Italian fine dining. The quality on display was consistent across all of the competitors' meals, however, and round after round the judges sampled each plate and glass. Before long, it was time for the judges to choose their winners. All of us uh, agreed that Stith, you are the overall winner. The runner-up was Copa Silva. I just got to show people what I love doing. And the best part was that people actually really enjoyed it. This is my main passion, which is cooking. I chose this MOS specifically because this is what I love doing. Reporting from Marine Corps Air Station, Iwakuni, Japan, I'm Marine Sergeant Joshua DeFore.